Yesterday, one of my YouTube viewers contacted me and asked what I would recommend as a protein supplement for bodybuilders. And the first thing that came to mind was uh, desiccated liver tablets. Now, let me go over the profile of a desiccated liver tablet. It's, it's quite substantial. Now, starting with the vitamin profile, I'm going to have to read this because I can't. there's no way I can remember this list. It's so long. Uh, vitamin A, uh, vitamin B complex, which would be B1, B2, uh, B6, and B12. Uh, uh, choline, uh, biotin, uh, niacin, panothenic acid, folic acid, PABA, vitamin C, D, E, K, uh, then the lipotropics, choline, and inositol. The mineral profile would include calcium, chromium, copper, heme iron, manganese, phosphorus, potassium, selenium, sodium, and zinc. Now, the amino acid profile would include alanine, arginine, aspartic acid, glycine, isoleucine, leucine, lysine, uh, tryptophan, tyrosine, valine, the, the list goes on. Uh, there's, there's, there's more than that. But uh, the, the, the profile is incredible. Now, now there's something that the, uh, the old uh, iron guru used to bring up all the time. Uh, one of the ingredients in this, uh, this uh, desiccated liver is, is something called cytochrome P450. What is cytochrome P450? Now cytochrome P450 is a detoxifying enzyme and it, it works in many ways. I mean, it's if you ingest anything that's toxic, it's going to pull it out of your system for you. It, and if you breathe anything like uh, carbon monoxide, cigarette smoke, it's going to isolate that and, and get, get rid of it for you. That's one of the things it does. Cytochrome P450 is also needed for the uh, breakdown and synthesis of uh, testosterone, cholesterol, estrogen, and it plays a critical role in the vitamin D metabolism. Now, all of us that have been around a while know that when I talk about desiccated liver tablets, they're, arg they're from Argentina, Argentine beef, and they're grass-fed. Now, the difference between that and anywhere else in the world is as you heard probably in the media, uh, these cattle that are in other parts of the world are, are fed steroids, they're, they're getting toxins from the water, they're getting toxins from being fed uh, recycled animals, and I mean just get all kinds of toxins from the environment and what they're being fed and what they drink, uh, and that concentrates in their livers. And so if you're gonna derive your protein from liver tablets, you want to have it from an organic source. You don't want to have all these toxins available. So uh, that's why we stick with the Argentine beef liver. Now the difference between heme iron and the iron supplements that you buy in the health food store is that heme iron is organic. The supplements that you would buy at the health food store are inorganic. They're difficult, if impossible, to digest. They uh, can cause uh, uh, stomach uh, issues. The uh, best source, one of the best sources, I'll say, of heme iron is liver. Now I doubt very much that you're going to be able to find these, these uh, desiccated liver tablets, the ones that I'm going to tell you about, in a health food store. It's possible you can try, I doubt it, because they're not, they're not uh, popular like whey. You know, people want to sell product. But uh, there are three brands that I would recommend, and Universal, Pirellos Performance, and Beverly International. Now what you want to look for are going to be 
30 grain. That's you know we talk about mill how many milligrams a tablet is. Well, these are these are calculated in grains. It's going to be 30 grains. It's probably going to be oh I don't know about the size of your the end of your pinky here. They're pretty good sized tablets. They're horse pills, you know. And uh, uh, I I think that you're going to find that you're going to recover faster. You're going to build muscle quicker. Uh, and you're going to have an increase in your uh, uh, immune system responses, uh, and, and the list goes on and on. I mean, it's just it's just incredible what what liver tabs have in them, and what they do for the body. And I would recommend uh, further research on your part. Uh, you might want to go look up some of uh, Vince Gironda's old uh, 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 writings on the internet, or uh, Dave Draper's written on this subject very well. Uh, I recommend Dave Draper too.